Hey guys, hope y'all are staying safe and healthy. I miss seeing you guys in the gym every day. I miss going to the gym myself every day, but I hope y'all are having fun, um, staying home and doing your workouts at home. Um, I'm not sure if you guys have seen on Instagram, but um, CrossFit um, headquarters is hosting a support your local box um, competition. So it's a three week competition. There's gonna be one workout announced per week and you can do the workout at your house. Um, all the, you can either donate um, or not donate. It's free technically to sign up, but if you wanna donate, the money would go towards your favorite CrossFit affiliate, AKA CrossFit Simplicity. Um, you're, you're also allowed to donate to other gyms that might be suffering right now financially. Um, but know that you don't have to donate. You can still sign up for free or you can't donate, so either one. And it's a great way to stay involved um, and do another type of community thing for our CrossFit community. So this past week they announced the first workout. It is a 10 minute AMRAP, and you're gonna be going from 10 air squats to nine dumbbell snatches on your right arm, then you'll do 10 push-ups, and then you'll do nine dumbbell snatches on your left arm. So you'll be rolling through that for 10 minutes, trying to get as many rounds and reps as possible. Um, there is an RX weight here. Um, it would be 35 pound dumbbell for the ladies and a 50 pound dumbbell for the guys. Now, if you don't have a dumbbell or you don't have um, that specific weight, that's fine. You can use any type of equipment that you can. Maybe you only have a kettlebell um, or I saw on the CrossFit page that they had some kid using a can of green beans. So <laughs> you can literally use for use anything that you can for this. Um, but if you do have a dumbbell, um, go ahead and use one of these for the workouts. But for your 10 air squats, let's go back here so you guys can see me. Um, make sure that we're getting squatting below parallel, keeping our chest up and our eyes are gazing forward, trying to keep our heels and our midfoot on the ground as well. Squat below parallel, stand a full extension at the top. So we'll do 10 there. Then you'll grab your dumbbell and you've got nine dumbbell snatches on your right arm. So typically we're used to doing alternating dumbbell snatches. This time we're gonna do all on the right hand before we do anything on the left hand. So same rules apply here. Um, the hand that's not holding the dumbbell has to be off in free space. Try not to um, use that as leverage off of the other leg. Um, but dumbbell starts in between your legs. Both heads of the dumbbell need to be on the ground to start. And then you'll go straight from ground to overhead. Once I'm overhead here, I'm gonna bring it back down with that same arm. Both heads of the dumbbell touch at the bottom and complete another one. So you can do it as a muscle snatch or we're not really bending back underneath or you can do it with a power snatch where we're dropping back underneath but make sure that you're standing at full extension at the top so you'll do nine there then you've got 10 push-ups so these are our regular push-ups full extension here um, make sure that we're keeping our body in that tight plank position Chest comes to touch the ground, fully extend back up. If you need to modify, you would just do knee push up, so drop to your knee. After that, last part of the round, we're doing nine dumbbell snatches on the left. So, same thing we did on the right, now we're switching to the left side. So, you complete all nine there. Once you're done with that, start back over with your air squats, and you'll keep rolling through that for 10 minutes. Have fun, guys.